Well, good morning again. It's Bill McCarthy from the Southwest Indian Foundation. Um, I hope you're well wherever you are. Uh, it's uh, we're getting close to the time where uh, it's it's buying purchasing gift season, uh, especially at the Southwest Indian Foundation where we do a ton of preparation. We we start stockpiling and preparing months and months ahead of time. And one of the uh, the categories that is is totally unique that you normally wouldn't find in shops uh, across the country is the uh, New Mexico uh, Southwest folk art. Uh, we have various pieces of, of folk art, and and the artists themselves, um, this is the way that they they make a living. Uh, we've uh, featured in in the past Harry Benali, and uh, we have a, a, another feature here of one of uh, of Harry's. The the woman here is the, is the sheep herder, and also if you go out into the pastoral areas on the Navajo Indian Reservation, this would not be an uncommon scene to see a woman on a donkey, perhaps herding her sheep. Uh, it's uh, it's very indicative uh, of the, of the life here. Um, all the second, the second item here is, a, as you well know, the uh, the state animal in New Mexico is the road runner. And if you look at this piece, is uh, the road runner wearing tennis shoes? And here again, if you if you're traveling around, it would not be uncommon to see a road runner scampering across the pavement. And it, it does kind of look as if. The Roadrunner would would actually be running with tennis shoes on. Um, this last piece here is the uh, is a little uh, figurine of one of the mission churches. I think this is from uh, San Geronimo's up in Taos, New Mexico, and you can just see the detail on this. I mean, the gentleman who who actually works on these is almost 90 years old, and he he's able to actually be so precise in the tiny little details. The, the, the gift of his eye and hand coordination and the ability to come up with such minute detail is absolutely exquisite. So these items will be offered in our catalog. Um, we're going to be sending out uh, large quantities coming up in the next uh, number of weeks. And so please be on the lookout for that. And, and perhaps you can even go on our website and when you purchase from the Southwest Indian Foundation you are providing a livelihood for these artists and these artists that do folk art so like share subscribe or comment and uh, please by all means continue to walk in beauty